Good morning. We're so thankful you're here to worship with us. If this is your first time here at Westgate, please make sure to stop by the welcome desk in the foyer for a special gift to let you know how glad we are that you're here. Please fill out the connection card in your bulletin and drop it in the collection plate later in the service. If you'd like the prayers of the Westgate Shepherds, be sure to fill out the back as well. Song packets with the worship service songs are available at the auditorium entrance. Also, be sure to stop by the information wall in the foyer to keep up with what's going on at Westgate. We will host the Dave Ramsey Financial Peace Seminar on Wednesdays beginning in March. The cost will be $95 per couple, but assistance is available. If you'd like to participate, please contact the church office as soon as possible. Sunday, February 23rd will be a special day as we host and honor the students, families, and staff of Westgate Christian School. We will recognize them at the end of the Sunday morning service. Please make a special effort to make them all feel welcome on this day. During World War II, Germany had the largest fleet of submarines in the world. In order to combat this arsenal, the British military teamed with the U.S. on Project Habakkuk to design an aircraft carrier capable of withstanding the frigid temperatures of the mid-Atlantic, where the German U-boats were known to roam. The scientists came up with a stealth vessel over 2,000 feet long that could carry a fleet of fighter jets and bombers, and that had a hull over 40 feet thick, capable of withstanding torpedo blasts. The project was approved, but the war ended before a prototype could be created. It turns out that it takes a lot longer than expected to build a 20 million ton ship made out of ice. In Isaiah, we read that the grass withers, the flower fades, but the word of our God will stand forever. A ship made out of ice will eventually melt, grass will eventually wither, flowers will eventually fade, but we worship a God who is eternal. He was before, he is now, and he always will be. And the really incredible thing is that we have the opportunity to commune with him, to talk to him, and to worship him. Let that sink in this morning and think about what an incredible gift that is. Please stand for the reading of God's word. <laughs> 